Aida, for altering my late cousin's wedding dress to use in my own wedding. English is not my first language, so I apologize for any spelling or grammar mistakes. About six years ago, my 28F cousin 29F, Kali fake name, moved to the same city as me. We grew extremely close and honestly clicked better than I had with anyone else. She quickly became my best friend. We met up all the time and even introduced me to my fianc 30 meters. When Kali got engaged, she asked me to be her maid of honor, and I accepted. We were both so excited, and she involved me in pretty much all the wedding planning. When her sister Anna found out that I was the maid of honor instead of her, she was furious. She claimed that Kali was turning her back on her real family and threw a fit. It got to the point where Anna got kicked out of the bridal party, and her parents almost boycotted the wedding. Fortunately, aside from a few petty comments from Anna, the wedding went off without a hitch. Shortly after, Kali helped my then boyfriend propose to me. Obviously, I asked Kali to be my maid of honor, and she suggested I also repurpose her wedding dress for mine as my something borrowed. Due to some issues with my future Phil's health, we decided to put off on the wedding, and during that time, Kali got pregnant and asked me and my fianc to be the baby's godparents. We brainstormed names together, went baby shopping, and I helped put together their nursery. I was so excited when Kali referred to me as her child's aunt, and I was over the moon to find out she was having twins. I started planning ways to accommodate Kali and her babies for my wedding, as I wouldn't want to have it without them. But to make a long story short, Kali passed away during labor, along with one of her twins. I was devastated, but stepped up to plan the funeral and help her husband, who had come to be one of my closest friends for the months after her death. It was honestly the hardest point in my life, and even a year later, I'm struggling to come to term with it all. A few months ago, I came to my cousin's husband and asked if I could still repurpose Kali's wedding dress like she suggested, thinking it would be a good way to honor her and still include her in my wedding, and he was all for it. The problem came when Anna called me, tearing into me that I'm a horrible person for altering her late sister's wedding dress without consulting her first. I tried to explain my side, but she said that I'm a selfish off for doing this when she deserves her sister's dress more. She claims that because she wasn't a part of the bridal party, this is her only way to feel connected to her sister's wedding. She made a long post on Facebook tearing into me, calling me all sorts of names and claiming that I'm insulting her sister's memory. I honestly don't know what to do. This has torn my family into two sides, and it's been incredibly hard on Kali's husband. Aita, 